Opposition sources say at least 16 insurgents have been killed in a bombing by a rival militant group in the Syrian city of Aleppo. Now, sources say the incident came after a militant from an Al-Qaeda linked group blew up his explosives at a site used by foreign-backed insurgents in the northern city. Sources say the attack was carried out by Al-Qaeda linked the Islamic State of Iraq and the Levant. Infighting among the insurgent groups in Syria has intensified in recent months, and this comes as the Syrian army continues to make gains in Aleppo. Joining us now is Professor Daoud Khairallah. He's with the Georgetown University, and he's joining us uh, from studios in Washington. Uh, Professor Khairallah, many thanks for joining us here on Press TV. Now, as this infighting continues, it seems that it's getting more extensive. Why do you think that is so, first of all? Well, it seems that those who are carrying weapons and carrying some terrorist activities in Syria are there doing the bids of uh, countries or parties that definitely are not the Syrian people. I doubt that the Syrian people, whatever uprising, whatever change, whatever reform they wanted, they wanted to uh, have the aspirations and the plans of Al-Qaeda or its derivatives or some other uh, group of different flavors than Al-Qaeda, but it is the same uh, ideological background uh, with no commitment to any form of democracy, no commitment from, to any form of human rights, fighting corruption, and anything that the Syrian people wanted. These are people who are doing the bids of outside forces and basically contributing to the destruction of Syria and to killing Syrians. Right now, as you've just pointed out, the situation is extremely dangerous and dire at the moment. Yet we see the so-called foreign-backed opposition in Geneva not even willing to discuss this issue of terrorism on Syrian soil. They represent, uh, according to their own claims, the voice of the Syrian people. Why do you think they're so hesitant to discuss the role that these insurgents are playing? Well, first, these insurgents are nothing more than fuel in the chimney of the foreign forces, foreign parties. As long as these foreign parties don't feel affected by what is going on in Syria, by the destruction in Syria, they have the luxury of waiting and doing whatever they want to do. I don't think that uh, those who are funding, promoting, and uh, arming and sponsoring and bringing mercenaries from all over the world, they really care very much for the life of these people. Uh, that's why we, we see these, the foreign element a little reluctant, because they are not seriously affected by what's going on in Syria. And that's very unfortunate. I don't think that a, a commitment to international law to human feelings, to the human suffering in Syria is what is guiding them and what is motivating them. All right, we're going to have to leave it there for now. That was Professor Daoud Khairullah with the Georgetown University joining us from studios in Washington. Uh, Professor, thank you very much indeed for your comments here on Press TV.